today. Lisa Steele lives in Suffolk. She grew up in the country and knows her way around the farm. Lisa's area of expertise is raising and caring for chickens the all-natural way. Yes, that means fresh eggs daily. We head to Suffolk for this week's edition of Wreck on the Road. You want to come out and look for bugs? Hi, my name is Lisa Steele, and I live in Suffolk, and I keep chickens. We've had chickens for about six years. We live out on a six-acre farm, and chickens are great. They're a great addition to any farm. They're great pets. They lay us wonderful fresh eggs, and they don't take up much room. They, they don't make much noise, as you can tell. And um, like I said, we've been doing it for about six years. I do it all naturally, no antibiotics, so we know what our family's eating. We don't eat our chickens. We just eat the eggs. And we also have ducks and horses, and we just kind of have a little Harvey Farm life here. Let's go see if anybody laid any eggs. Right now we have about 15 chickens. We've had up to three dozen, um, but that's kind of a lot. You know, I name them, and I like to keep track of them, and, and we get an awful lot of eggs from three dozen chickens. They lay about an egg a day. Not every day, but... A good layer will lay five to six eggs a week, so three dozen eggs is a lot of eggs. <laughs> um, so we have about 15 chickens now and 10 ducks, and collect the eggs every day. Um, they lay less in the winter, a little, little more in the summer. Around here, it's farm country, so pretty much everyone has chickens. I mean, we give eggs to the, the mail lady, the UPS man, you. I mean, everyone who comes in the driveway leaves with eggs. Um, but you can't, there's no market for them because everyone raises their own chickens. We get blue eggs from our Americanas, and these olive green ones are from olive eggers. And then our Orpingtons lay the, the tan-colored eggs. <laughs> Well, anytime after about 18 weeks old, the chicken will start laying eggs. And she'll lay for a good two or three years, pretty regularly, about an egg a day, every 26 hours. And then after that, they slow down. But I still have a six-year-old hen, and she lays about one egg a month. Um, but they they just head to the nesting boxes, and, and um, I think it takes about 20 minutes. They get comfortable and, you know, feel like it's a safe place for their egg. And they lay their egg, and then... They go on to enjoy the rest of their day, and the next day they do it all over again. Well, I turned this whole chicken hobby thing kind of into a career. I'm an author. I wrote a book last year called Fresh Eggs Daily, which is also the name of my blog. I've been blogging for about four years um, and kind of turned the blog into a book, teaching people how to raise chickens naturally and not use antibiotics or chemicals, because that's the whole point of having your own eggs is that you know what they're eating and it's not chemicals. Um, the book has done really well, and it's been a bestseller in the chicken category on Amazon, which is pretty <laughs> exciting. Um, but it's just basically a, a basic, here's how to raise your chickens, here's how to do it naturally. Um, so I do that, and I write my blog, and I have a Facebook page also called Fresh Eggs Daily. And I just kind of try to educate and inspire and encourage people to raise chickens. I think one of the neat things about raising chickens is that it's such a quick period that if you decide you want to hatch some eggs, um, it just takes three weeks, and it goes from egg to baby chick, which, you know, is pretty fascinating. And for kids to be involved in an animal where they can see that, that cycle of life in such a quick period. Um, and, of course, if, if you don't have a rooster, then, you know, your eggs are never going to hatch. But it's still pretty neat to collect them every day and give them to friends and neighbors and anybody who drives in the driveway. FreshEggsDaily.com. Look at these things. Beautiful, huh? They're still dirty. You gotta wash them off while we eat them. Um, there was that one um, chicken in the story that was um, cooing, I guess. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> I wanted his impression. Did you make Eggy Smeggy with me? Not yet, but you we gonna, will. Okay, Eggy Smeggy. We'll do the Eggy Smeggy. Stick around, everybody. Right. We'll be right back. Swordfish tacos.